Hey guys, I've got a quick little kind of silly video for you guys, but I figured someone out here actually wants this and actually wants to see it. But I figured out how to get Thomas characters on Train Simulator 2020. So we're going to hop right into it and I'm going to show you. First off, you're going to need a WinRAR. Let me see, I should have gotten ready with this earlier, but WinRAR. Um, you come on here and you will get um oh where do i go right here winrar download free come here and you will download winrar i will put this link in the description so you can come here you will click on this you don't need to buy it you can click it uh click download and it'll just download for you for free but this is how you're going to get the um, file where you need it and you will see that later but next you will come to sodorrails.webs.com I will also put this in the description when you come here you will come it'll it'll say home uh, welcome and you'll go to engines this is where you get your engines Thomas realistic Thomas TV series uh, Edward is here despite um, there not being a picture he is just click on that you can get Edward Henry Gordon now with Gordon I have had issues I've not gotten him to work yet um, but I might be able to in the future James Percy Toby, Duck, Donald and Douglas, Bill and Ben, Oliver, Stepney, uh, Diesel, and uh, Unfinished Mavis, Bovis, and, or sorry, Boko and Daisy. None of these are usable, and I don't know if they ever will, because I don't know if they're still working on it. But all these engines up here you can get. Now I'm going to show you how to get Thomas real quick. It's really fast, really simple. So, first thing you want to do is just click on the picture simple it'll come up you're going to click on this download button right here this green download now if this comes up which it probably will you don't need to click on this download and you do not want to click on this download that is an easy way to get viruses so you do not want that you can exit right out of that as you can see down here on the bottom left uh thomas our thomas guy is already downloading so don't worry about that now in the meantime while that's downloading what you can do is you can pull up your your file viewer right here when you do that you want to go to this pc windows your c drive you will most likely go to program files 86 and then steam will be right about in this area however mine is outside so after you go in there go to steam steam apps common railworks and if i went through that fast i apologize but just go ahead and pause the video and go back anytime you need to i have all these mods in here that you will not have you won't have this much on here but what you will have is utilities you want to double click on utilities yes bring that up go to package manager and refresh now this is done installing i already have it installed what you'll do is you'll click on it Heck, I'll just do it right now. You'll click on it, and it'll come up like this. You can double-click on that. Don't worry about this. I really don't know what it is. I kind of read through it, but it's, it doesn't really make sense to me. But what you will do is you will grab this one TV series dot, dot, be, ugh, one TV series dot RWP, and you will drag it out here. So right there it is on your desktop. I already have it in here, but I can still show you what exactly I will do. So you'll click install here. Um, go to desktop, and it'll be the top one right there. Click on that and click open. It'll open up, and it'll look like this. And then it'll pop up just like that, one TV series with today's date. Now, you can minimize that, minimize this, go into your game. Now, once you get here to the main menu, you're going to go to Drive. And then you're going to go to Quick Drive. You're going to click on this. There might, there'll probably be an engine here showing, not this picture right here. But then you'll go to Custom, Create New, Confirm. And this will load up. Once it loads up, you can go to Steam. Scroll down until you get to Thomas. 
And now Thomas One TV is not showing up here, so I don't think he's gonna work. However, Thomas One TV 3D face shows up like that. TV CGI shows up like that. And faceless, you also get faceless, shows up like this. I'm gonna go with the CGI one because I haven't tried him out yet. You're going to click add to front. Next, I'm gonna do Thomas test two because I've already tested him out once. Now I'm gonna, once it gets to here, you have to come back to this picture, click on custom again, scroll down until you see Thomas test two or whatever you named it yourself. You probably won't have this much stuff on here unless you're making as many trains as I am. So next you will go on and pick your line and I'm just gonna take Riviera line in the 50s because it's British and it makes sense. Uh, just click wherever to start it. Make your weather however you want it. And click start. Now once it pops up you'll see that we're on the inside here. It's pretty dark in here so it might just be because I'm in this area but I don't know but look we have Thomas unfortunately Thomas has no noises and I don't know why there's no whistle there's no nothing but he will drive he will go just as any other engine would um, I'm still trying to figure out how I get sounds if I do eventually I will share that However, for the meantime, you just get Thomas. Let's go inside and see if it's less dark. Okay, yeah, so it's less dark in here. You can see all the controls. They're not clickable or anything like that. But, hey, we've got Thomas in Train Simulator. I don't think we can ask for a whole lot more than that. So, that's how you get Thomas. The same way will work for all the other... Um, engines his light does show up on the front there but I don't know oh you can hear that noise in the background but that's not Thomas that's just another train that's coming up and the red light is showing up on the back kind of sorta uh, and the front light does show up a little bit so there are a few things that aren't great with this Thomas model, but like I said, we have Thomas. There goes another train. But like I said, we have Thomas in Train Simulator, and that's that's fine by me. So that method will work for any of those locomotives as long as the files are completely good and complete. Which with um, Gordon, I don't think they exactly are something must be wrong so I don't know if Gordon will ever work unfortunately but we have Thomas here working and uh, I'm going to actually go and download a few more and try and make a little Thomas video so we'll see how that turns out you guys will um, feel free to check out my channel to see that next but I hope you guys can go out and get your Thomas the tank engine and I hope you guys enjoy it as much as I will all right you guys have a good rest of your day